So Live in Farms uh, is doing uh, scalable insect farm technology. So we grow insects as an as a meat alternative, as a protein alternative. So we developed a desktop insect hive, we call it hive, uh, to grow your own edible insects in your home. So this is a, it's a very educational product for, for people to, to try it themselves. So we give them the tools, empower them. We launched uh, uh, this product uh, last year with a Kickstarter campaign, and we're now about to, to ship our first units. I wanted to look for alternatives to traditional meat uh, production. Uh, and that's how I came about insects, because insects are very high protein. It's a superfood. It has fibers, which other meat doesn't have. Uh, it has vitamin B12, B5. Uh, in Chinese traditional medicine, you have a lot of, of insects. That, that is for a reason. Um, so it is really a good way to, uh, to incorporate proteins in, into your diet, um, into your diet um, without without having necessarily a lot of uh, you know saturated fats. It's roasted warm, so they're frozen and then they're roasted just with a bit of salt without any additional oil. They contain a lot of fat, but it's very healthy fats. They can be grown on very small spaces um, and uh, with very little water, we can grow, grow them on, on uh, kitchen scraps, on waste materials, materials that we can't use as, as food anymore. We don't necessarily need fertile ground anymore to grow feed, to feed insects. Um, and that's the, that's the big opportunity here. I would say that one of the key things is is storytelling. I think that's uh, that's that's what we do a lot also with our product. Um, we people need to know why they would even bother to to think about eating something else than they would usually eat, right? Um, and if they know how it is grown, that it is healthy, that it's clean, it's much cleaner really to to grow them than other types of meat. And then of course it's also the taste. It's very versatile. You can put them into all kinds of dishes and recipes. You don't need to change your eating habits really to in order to incorporate it into your everyday food. It can be in a pasta sauce, it can be in meatballs. You don't need to see them as the whole insect. Yeah, it's really good. It's just, um, it's quite uh, nutty. Uh, consistency is really crunchy and uh, that makes it really good to, to put into all kinds of dishes.